what is up everyone welcome back to another video we have these lexus they're both 17 inch rims i believe they're going to be going gloss black we're just going to do a quick little video on how to properly professionally paint uh wheels at home do it yourself and make them look as uh close to oem finish as possible over here you can see this is what we're going to be using for today's video all this stuff is can be purchased at a Canadian Tire, a home hardware store, Walmart, whatever. So we're gonna be going gloss black. We have our primer, black primer, our uh, gloss clear coat, and then obviously the gloss black paint as well. All right guys, so first step, what we're gonna do, we have some brake cleaner. There may be some other better stuff on the market, but that's just what we have. Find it works the best, add in some alcohol. We're just gonna go ahead, give the inside of the barrels a nice clean and make sure there's just no brake dust or just any contaminants on the wheel whatsoever so we're gonna go ahead and do that and i'll give you guys an update what they kind of look like when they're finished because you can see right now they are disgusting paint will not stick to this even if you do paint it it's gonna look very textured and it's not gonna be the finish you guys want so we got the wheels pretty much wiped down as best as we can you can see from what they were before a lot better i'm going to give them one more wipe down with a little bit more alcohol and then we're going to get going to put the primer base on and once i do the primer i'll give you guys a little update just to kind of show you about how much you should be putting for each coat obviously your first coat is the most important you just want to dust it make sure everything's nice and leveled that way it adds on for a nice even finish so I'm gonna give these guys one more wipe down and then we'll get to the primer. got the first coat on as you guys can see it's just a dust coat just so it's enough that the primer is going to stick to the wheels so we're just going to let this sit for about maybe five minutes and then we're going to go on with the second coat fill in some of the gaps and just put a more solid uh full coat on and uh, i'll give you guys an update then I just finished up the next coat you guys can see very big difference it's a lot more full there's still small little patches that i uh, have to touch up 100 percent but this is pretty much what we're looking for i'll probably put one more coat on top then um i'm gonna flip the uh, wheels over and then we're gonna go ahead and primer the rears because if you're gonna do the job right you might as well do the inside of the barrels too that way it just there's no mismatch colors all right quick little update guys i'm just letting these dry you can see we have the inside of the wheels and the outside fully primered. We're just letting it cure. That last one we have sitting there. So we're just gonna let these boys cure a little bit longer. So we just finished up one of the last coats of paint. You guys can see, they're really starting to look glossy. We're just going ahead, let these dry for another, well, 10 minutes or so. I put one more coat on and then we're going to start the clear coat. Just like that, all finished. So you guys, you've seen the steps, you've seen us do it. Now it's time for you guys to go do it yourself. Very easy, you know, it'll take a couple hours, but with the right, right preparation, the job will turn out perfect. You can see how glossy all these wheels are. Fronts and backs all the way around. No missed spots. 
100% painted. Just zoom up a little bit so you guys can see. Obviously, there are a lot of imperfections in the wheels themselves, but the paint is flush and smooth all the way across. Mm -hmm. 